All right, I brought the little jump starter slash air compressor out and hooked it up. And as you can see, tire's a little slack. Okay, I figured it out. Some of these you gotta hit them twice and this one you gotta hold it down and start. It's set at 36 pounds, looks like. So here's the young man's new BMW. Right, bud? All right. I'm not lying. That's a Vega motor. I think we'll remove that. Yes, I think we will. Maybe five minutes later, it's up to 29 pounds. Maybe not quite five minutes. We'll let it go to 32 and then stop it. And see how much battery power we have left. All right, now we're at 32. Look at that, 96%. That's that kind of surprises me. That's pretty good. Because it ran a long time. Alright, let's see if it'll do all four tires. 15. We'll take that to 32 also. I got distracted and let it go and it shut off at 36 pounds. So that's pretty handy. It is getting quite warm right there. Let's put it on the uh, other wheel. <clears throat> oh, I gotta hold it. 88% after two. That's amazing. All right, we got that one to 36 pounds. Now we'll go to the right front. That's three tires so far. It's fairly warm right there. It's got 18 pounds in it. Now it's at 50% after, let's read it right side up, after four tires. That tire is plumb flat. Let's see if it'll pump it all the way. 36. Good. That's tire number five. Itself. Battery's at 30% now. 
and that tire was pulling flat. I think that's pretty good. I'm kind of impressed, honestly. If I had a car with a dead battery, I'd jump it now and see what happens. All right, now we're going to test it out on this 1985 GMC, which has two dead batteries. It's a 6.2 diesel, and it's got to run the glow plugs before it'll start. So I'm curious to see what it'll do. All right, it's hooked up. Let's see if it'll run. Give it a shot, bud. Glow plugs first. Drawing it right down. <laughs> I'm kind of shocked. They fired it right up, no problem. And this thing has one, two batteries. So, all in all, I'm a little surprised that thing cranked that old 6 2 diesel. And it did a good job pumping up tires, so <clears throat> I'd say it's worth it. I'm going to post the video, put a link in the description, and uh, y'all go check it out. It's Mr. Heavy Chevy recommended.